bit of trouble here down the two games to love. Wang Li Chin, tall figure at the other end, 1 meter 83 against the youngster who really is as cool and calm as collected as you could uh, possibly imagine. And he's in with a great chance here. Well, this is how it's gone the first couple of games. Wang Hao looks remarkably composed for one so young, but the thing with Wang Li Chin, Basha, is his expression never changes. We've seen him down. He almost doesn't bother playing till he's down a couple of games. Uh, yes, sir, Brian. I remember that World Championship final when he was left to down against uh, Kong Ling Hui, a former world champion, and uh, he pulled off uh, a fantastic win in that match to become world champion. And uh, he's going to have to do something similar right here because uh, Wang Hao is playing uh, out of his skin. Two love up, four love up. And uh, what a player he is, the young 18-year-old. Wang Chin isn't too old himself. He's only 23. Just the jab into the uh, open table. This uh, China Open, the fifth event on the Pro Tour season. There are 13 events altogether, culminating with the Pro Tour finals, which uh, Wang Li Chin uh, was beaten in the final earlier this season by uh, earlier this uh, year by Ma Lin. But Wang Michin is the defending champion of the China Open. He has won a lot of uh, tournaments on the tour, especially in 2000, where he won the China Open, the Japan Open, the US Open, and he also won the Grand Final. They won three last year as well, China, England and Sweden. Very tall, lanky player is Wang Lichin, has uh, obviously fantastic reach, especially on his extreme forehand. And his favorite shot, uh, he plays very good backhand counter shots, and then he moves to his extreme backhand corner and uh, plays fantastic forehand top spins, both cross court and down the line. He's getting a lot of uh, cheap service points right now from Wang Hao. A couple of returns from him uh, going into the net. Well, we've seen him, uh, we've actually seen him get a couple of points like that. We've seen him miss the edge of the table as well in this game, where he goes to the backhand side, and he obviously reckons that Wang Hao is a little bit slow in moving across. Wang Hao is the penholder grip player, but he has a superb backhand job spins. And uh, so far, he really hasn't played that shot very well. He's... Uh, attempted to move to his extreme backhand corner and because of that he's leaving a lot of his forehand open well how did he get out of the way to play that last forehand Wang Hao put it straight back at the body that reply there it seemed as though he got the angle absolutely right Wang Li Chin still came up with the winner got the new service rule of operation now where the uh, server is not allowed to mask the ball either with his body or his uh, free arm at any point in uh, executing the serve. So, uh, so even there, there was a bit of masking, but the free arm, you know, it's almost inevitable. The free arm, just for balance, is going to yeah. be out in front. Yeah, that's uh, going to be a very, very difficult uh, rule to implement. OK, if you hide the ball with your body, fair enough. Uh, that shouldn't be allowed. But with your free arm, it kind of balances the whole uh, body weight. And it's very difficult to uh, pull up a player because of that. There's the flick catching Wang Hao down the forehand side. Eight apiece. tight now and this young man is uh, two games to love up already oh clever return so here we go game four 
Wang Hao at the far end leading two games to one. Great reflexes playing very both men playing very close to the table. It is remarkable though, I mean you mentioned that uh, Wang Li Chin here is almost a veteran but he's only 23. Now they're getting chased by the, well it was just too much, a very good serve, too much hide on the return. China has come up with uh, so many top class players. Wang Hao took out uh, another world champion, Liu Guoliang, in the quarterfinals. And a superb win for him. Liu and uh, Kong Ling Hui, also a former champion, were ousted in the earlier rounds. And uh, he beat Kong Ling Hui before that in the pre quarterfinals. So, what a tournament Wang Hao has had. He had a dream start to this uh, semi final match, too, but he's allowed Wang Yichin right back into it. He was uh, 2 0 and 4 love up in the third game before Wang Yichin won it 12 10. When he won the Egyptian Open earlier this year, he was uh, world ranked 43. So he's made fairly rapid progress. Now up to uh, 20. And in that Egyptian Open, uh, Brian, if you remember, he won his semi final and uh, final with such ease. He didn't drop a single game to Samsonov. And then he beat uh, Jean Michel Saiv in the final. And that was a. Uh, Fantastic performance by the 18 year old. Oh, Wang Li Chin looks as though he'd done the hard work. Fending off two great attacking forehands. A lot of spin on the ball there from Wang Hao. Unbelievable to see a penholder grip player playing uh, backhand counter shots like that. Look at those backhand top spins. And the deception on the down the line from Wang Hao. Fantastic. These were fantastic shots from Wang Hao. First, he got to the extreme forehand and then uh, two beautiful down the line shots. Completely wrong footed Wang Li Chin there. He was moving to his backhand side. He's missed a few of those in this match. The whole of the body weight is going one direction. He's loosening the wrist and trying to get to the opposite Go. corner. Good placement from Wang Yichin. He had Wang Hao stretching to the extreme forehand, but uh, again, a beautiful flighted forehand top spin from Wang Hao. And uh, there's enough spin on the ball to put uh, Wang Yichin off. And a very short uh, return of serve from Wang Hao gives him five game points. Game points for Wang Hao. And his serve. There it is. Long from Wang Li Chin. 3 1. Wang Hao leads. Producing area for China. And, uh, China open, obviously, for the Chinese who make up the real cream of the ITTF Pro Tour this is the uh, biggest event on the tour for them and we've got uh, the world's number one the current world's number one and I'm sure a future world's number one in action here in the semi-final that's the youngster leading 3-1 he needs one more game 
Best of seven games. Well, the first one down the forehand side didn't quite do the job. Big forehand follow-up certainly did. Having made a stretch for the first ball to the extreme forehand and then uh, falling behind a bit was Wang Hao in that rally. Very good short serve, a lot of uh, underspin on the ball and Wang Lichin's return goes straight to the bottom of the net. And the backhand top spin this time. So Wang Hao really putting a lot of pressure on the world champion. to see those sort of rallies where both players are away from the table but uh, both hitting aggressive shots and Wang Yichin really played aggressively in that point uh, even though Wang Hao had gotten with the first forehand top but he just continued attacking a lot of backhand uh, counter errors from Wang Hao shots go for winners so he just didn't expect the ball to come back and look at this reflex action from Wang Hao to parity He's not far from knocking out the world champion Olympic champion and defending champion Peng Li Chin six apiece both players are playing a short game and then uh, Wang Hao playing that backhand open he has uh, missed a few of those but uh, that one was played very well straight to the center of the table He started that swing from round about sort of ankle height. So quick. Taking the ball very early there and uh, having side spin on it that moved away from Wang Hao's forehand. He didn't get it across the net, but he got it back on the other side of the table. That's enough to win uh, Wang Lichin the point. Funny how that can unsettle the player who should have the advantage when he gets back. You almost sort of relax, you think you've won the point. Sneaky little underarm serve from Wang Hao. His body half turned. Straight away looks at his uh, racket in case there's a little bit of sweat on the ball or on the rubber. But uh, that was his mistake. Just wanting to attack uh, a little bit too much straight away on the service return. Chin, uh, the ball just grazing the top of the net and that's why the timing from Wang Hao was wrong two game points for Wang Chin. Oh. 
very deep, looks like caught the edge of the table. And this time he's uh, successful in uh, getting Wang Lichin away from the table, but uh, still a very good forehand topspin played by Wang Hao. Which it wasn't near the edge, was it? It was just nice and deep. Oh, look at the reach. What a point. Made of uh, Lung Fist, sort of the next generation or the latest generation with lots of Valtner. Person, or, well, we keep thinking they're going to retire every tournament we do, but uh, they're still hanging around. But uh, for how much longer? I'm not quite sure. Wanda got to the quarterfinals uh, here in the China Open. He lost to Oh Sang Hoon, the player who we'll be seeing uh, in the next semi final from Korea. Wang Richard stays close to the table, takes the ball very early and uh, plays it cross court for a winner. All over that one. Easily his favorite shot, the one where he moves to the extreme backhand corner, bends low and then hits the winner down the line. attack throughout that rally ends up putting it in the net what an amazing exchange 12 13 forehand top spins were played by Wang Lichin and all were played to Wang Hao's backhand he was just hoping that Wang Hao being the pen holder grip player would lose the point uh, but ultimately it's he who's pushed to the extreme backhand and then plays the top spin into the net what a serve what a difference with the uh, crowd involvement between this one and uh, the Italian Open, where we had, uh, well, I was going to say two men and a dog, even the dog wasn't there. <laughs> <laughs> Held at uh, Courmayeur in the uh, Italian Alps. And they weren't even all out skiing. It was, <laughs> it was uh, the start of summer. Really playing well now, Wang Lichin. He's picked up a gear and uh, attacking very well right now. A couple of shots uh, straight to Wang Hao's body to the center of the table. And that ball really took off after it bounced for the second time. almost that shot time and time again Wang Lichin has played that short return and uh, so many times Wang Hao has hit that backhand open into the net is really keeping the pressure on the backhand of Wang Hao. Even from a static position there, he's managed to come up with an attacking shot, that flick right in front of the body. He shows beautiful control on those backhand counter shots, does Wang Li Chin. He's also able to play the backhand uh, top spins in between the counter shots. Just uh, so to add a little bit more spin on the ball, it takes away the speed.
Well, the ball seemed high enough on the service return for Wang Hao to finish it. Too much of spin of the ball, and Wang Hao tries to play a forehand top spin of his own. Too much top spin off the table catches the they are going to play it's three games apiece wang hao the 18 year old youngster was two love up wang li chin has pulled him back he was two love up and three one up and wang li chin has come back strongly to win the last two games 11 9 and uh, 11 5 and he'll start off the decider And is superb from Wang Hao. He does tend to make a lot of errors, especially on the block and the counter shots. And Wang Yichun is just going to keep continuing the pressure on his backhand, hoping that Wang Hao will keep continuing the errors. And uh, what a winner this was from Wang Yichun. Well, that's the other side of the coin, isn't it? You keep the attack going over to the backhand side. Wang Hao moves further and further that way, exposing that forehand. Called by Wang Hao because he's uh, lost the first three points in this deciding game. So I have no coach to go and talk to, which they would probably have if uh, they were elsewhere other than in China, or, or if uh, it, it were it was not two Chinese players playing together. Three Chinese in the amongst the four semi-finalists, Oh Sang Yun of Korea, the only interloper, will be playing in the next semi-final against Qin Ji Jian, who's uh, better known as the double specialist. And he's done really well to get this far in the singles of his uh, national open. Running it difficult to win points against the world champion right now, uh, really having to get his body out of the way on that shot. And hits it a little too long for love. And, uh, he goes straight to the body of Wang Yichun this time. a pretty high return across the net and uh, Wang Lichin just maybe thought it was uh, a bit too easy in the end and then that looping forehand topspin of his Wang Lichin takes the no sorry they're just yeah. changing ends Straight at the body of Wang Li Chin. A lot of uh, spin off the, the roll of wrist. Oh dear, oh dear. That was pretty comprehensive from Wang Li Chin. 
beautiful shot from Wang Lichin, uh, getting just the time kind of return that he wants, a third ball attack, and uh, it's really in his comfort zone, right at the center of the table. Well, he's done the hard work, Wang Hao coming up with a quicker serve again, which uh, he used to great effect earlier in the match. Wang Chin has that ability to sway his body out of the way to, to uh, enable him to get the shots back. It's good depth. chance there because uh, he was playing the attacking shots first he had opened up the rally for himself but uh, on the second shot he goes into the net shot. trying to up the pace on that backhand jab was Wang Li Chin he played uh, two three very good shots cross court Last shot by Wang Li Chin was more of a push rather than a roll, which meant that he lost a little bit of control. Shot. Oh, suddenly, Wang Hao coming back. Remember, this is the seventh and deciding game in the semi final. Shot. Again, the quicker serve. He's not at all uh, scared to go for that quick serve to Wang Lijin's backhand. He knows that all Wang can do is play the backhand open. And he's really prepared to go for it. Wang Lijin takes his time out. One time out apiece. Available to each player per game. The serve is really very deep and uh, very quick to Wang Lijin's body. really anybody's game right now the 18 year old relatively in inexperienced though he has uh, of course won a tournament on the tour against uh, the world champion footwork from Wang Hao and he now goes into the lead what a shot that was from Wang Hao just uh, slapped the first ball down the line to Wang Li Chin's forehand oh a little bit of uh, luck going Wang Li Chin's way because that ball hit the net there was a lot of spin on it and uh, Wang Hao couldn't do anything with it because he was just going through with the shot Backhand jump spin from Wang Hao. Oh, yes. The jab straight down the table into the open there area. Well, it's been a fantastic match. This close in the deciding game. Another good serve. He has served well, Wang Hao. Oh. <laughs> Wang Hao tried to play that shot on instinct. He, he wasn't looking anywhere near the ball. He just wanted to uh, take the ball so early on the bounce, and uh, he had seen Wang Lichin a little bit away from the table, 
and uh, that's why he wanted to uh, become the aggressor. But those were very powerfully played forehand options from Wang Lichin. Match point. Well, great defense in the end, won it for Wang Lichin.